so it's me your boy k samson so i have this message for us you know sometimes let the spirit of god lead you to a point where you will be able to do or to discover those who are really with you you know the world we are living today many people whom you are saying are not really whom they are saying they are so what am i trying to say is this be careful with whom you allow into your life <laughs> i'm here to tell you some certain things so many people will come into your life for the for different motive from different what purposes so try to discover those who are really are really ready to assist you because many people will come into your life for the sake to so, to do or to forsake you yes there are those who come into your life devil himself just send them assignment because they discover and notice the potential you carry so whoever is not ready to support you is already against you <laughs> people said how can we know those who are who are ready to support us how can we discover them in the first place so one reason one way to discover those who are ready to support you is what is a mist whether they have small they don't have small they will always be there mostly people who do something for you without promising you yes this is one this is the reason why i was frustrated in years back so some people will come into your life the moment they just step they'll start to promise you heaven and earth so this disconnect yourself from this type of people who come into your life and the first thing they do is to promise you something believe me someone who wants to assist you will never promise you he will just do it for surprise believe me so the reason why i decide to do what to do this video is because i don't want anyone anyone up there to experience what i have experienced or what i have gone through so you need to discover them by their fruit and two of it is that many people will they will start to ask you where you come from <laughs> you know that is what hurt me mostly yes <laughs> so anytime i was in school then uh, this particular lady always asked me uh, uh, can you tell me about your family your background where you come from your your name your parents your this your that so at the point you know someone I, i'm a type of person that i don't know when someone is trying to use me i don't know when people are lying within me when people are trying to take advantage of me i don't know it why because i was not used to it and my parents are not liars my sisters are not liars my aunties are not liars so i was brought up in a family in a in a family with background in a christ background let me put it in this way in a body of christ that is who, where i was growed out so anything concerning lie i don't know it it is when i uh, i enter here in italy that i decide uh, you know i start to do to identify them notice them so like now i will see some of um, some of um, you know let me put in the, some of people many of them will still come to me and be try, trying to do or to repeat the same thing that have already happened in my past so when they use the trick that people have used to do or to use me people have used so the moment they do or they say the same word then i just recall or reflect what have happened before so when someone start to you know ask you in order for him to know the deep part of you just allow them to go they are not made to do or to help you because someone who is ready to help you elevate you assist you support you will not care where you come from maybe like in a relationship someone who really love you will not even start to ask you is your father as this is your mother this because most of them want to discover if your father if your family is what is capable or if they are what if they are rich they are this they are that because some people will look at your background before they will use you you know what i'm saying so <laughs> you know when i start to recall some certain things that i passed through because of my experience in the past uh, the way people used to you know because of how i narrate things about me to them 
and they start to use it against me. So, with all those things, I, 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 I smile. Sometimes I smile, sometimes I feel bad of myself. I feel like I regret of what of allowing opening myself to them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yes, truly, I regret because I open up all myself to them. So the issue, the three of it is that don't whoever is trying to know your secret. When I mean your secret, your personal secret is dangerous. When someone try to you know ask you uh, things like your finance, things about your business, your issue, not that. If they want to learn, it's another way. When someone starts to tell you how much do you end in a month, how much do you end this, how much do you end that, know that they are not there to support you. They are just there to waste and use you. Yes, you need to discover this. So, some people come into your life because devil himself sent them assignment. Because sometimes, the reason why Delilah was sent into the life of Samson is because they want to use Delilah to destroy and terminate the life of Samson. So don't let toxic or narcissist people come into your life because their aim of coming is just for them to waste your years, destroy you and steal from you. So separate yourself from those who are not ready to support you. Because these type of people, they are toxic, they are narcissists, they don't care. All they care is their own benefit. Believe me, the only thing that they care is that they get and use you. You know what I'm saying? So separate yourself from people who act as if they love you, but they don't. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> those days, this lady used to tell me, anything we say, anything we talk, you always believe. There's no one we, we, we tell you you don't believe. You always believe everything because I'm not, I was not used to it. So separate yourself from people who want to use you. Mostly those who, who want to know everything concerning you. Your background, your this, your dad. Uh, sometimes in a relationship, yes, it is good not to hear something from what? From your partner. But be wise as a serpent and be harmless as a dove. There are some certain things you ought not to tell your partner. Yes, <laughs> I tell you. There are some certain secrets you need to keep within yourself because time will come that your partner you call your partner may become your ex. So whenever, when she becomes your ex, that may turn against you. That may, she may start to use that your secret against you. That is the reason why there are some certain things you ought to keep private and there are some certain things you ought to speak because you want to get what information in return. You know what I'm saying? It's not everyone who open up their mind, eh? Who open up their teeth, tattoo teeth, eh? Who do we love you? Oh, are still are still happy because you are happy, brothers. Let's be real. Let's be careful. Not everyone who tell you they love you really do. If so, why Delilah was with Samson, smiling, eating, kissing, doing all sorts of things, pleasant life, and yet she was sent to destroy them. So, we need to be careful with those who smile with us. We need to be careful the way we open up ourselves to people thinking that they love us. Yes, we need to be careful when we come to a point of trying to open up ourselves to some particular categories of people. Because their aim of coming is not to support you. People will come into your life not because they have the mindset or the, or the intention to support you. They don't have none. Their intention is never to support you. Their intention is never to do or to assist you. Their intention or their mindset is never to elevate you. Many of them have different mindset, different what bad motive, different attitude. Some are just there because they want to watch and see the end, how you will end. Some are just there because they want to witness your failure. <laughs> it is hard. Let's be real, it's hard. So in those days there was a you know there was a reverend father after the incident. So there was a reverend father and one lawyer that was present when something occurred in my life, in my past life. So this reverend father started to do what betrayed me. So she he, he himself start it's not the reverend father, let me put it in that kind they call it they call them capkis when when reverend father is not around, someone who takes charge. So the same thing that this woman used to repeat, say, talk, this, this, this man started to repeat the same thing. 
trying to ask me some deep things that I've already said before. And then I decided to do what? To distance myself from him. Because I know that he wants to know more about me the way I have already shared my information, my, my life to someone who I trust, thinking that she is with me, not knowing she's a vampire, a devil in disgust. So what am I trying to say is this? be careful when someone try to ask the deep part of you. The, be careful when someone is trying to know everything about you. It's very, very dangerous. When someone just come and you want to know everything concerning you, believe me. That's why when country want to world war, what do they do? They go to the other country to survey, to know the, the leaking point. So, some people come into your life because they want to know your leaking point. The mist in which they can enter and destroy you. Maybe someone have come, they have tried all means to humiliate you, but they are not. <laughs> some people will say, how can devil in this place use another the same way we christianity we communicate we have verb you can understand that pastor today pastor like pastor in nigeria can have a communication in what in africa so pastor in italy can have a communication with pastor in what in egypt in morocco in different country that is the same way devil and east age the bible said their spirit bear weakness so so be careful with someone whom you open up your mind to keep yourself because the moment they discover that you are called for greatness the moment they discover that there's something huge in you they'll start to fight you they'll start to make any move in order for them to frustrate you you know what i'm saying so that is the reason why you need to keep yourself secretly your life secretly your personality your mode your system mostly your blessing you know what i'm saying keep it within yourself because the devil you know it's more better than the ones you don't know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's, it's very difficult for you to fight whom you don't know. So those people who eat with you, who want to know everything about you, are the worst devil acting as a friend. You know what I'm saying? So remain blessed and be blessed. May God bless you. If you have not subscribed, kindly subscribe and remain blessed.